I'd like to take a look at the system browser. It's pretty awesome to have around. Before I even show it, again, I recommend that you have two monitors at least. So to make that show up, we can do one of two things. I can find any open space and right click, go to browsers, I can find system browser. Or I can go to the view tab, I can go to user interface, and I can come down to system browser. So I'm going to turn that on. Now I'm going to minimize all my fields. And as we can see, we have 12 piping systems. So I'm going to drill into here. And when I select domestic cold water, I can drill into this. I see that we have water closets. We have all kinds of stuff. So what's nice about this is we can see our systems. But if I select this water closet, right click and show, I'm going to zoom right in on that actual item. That's why I love this so much. So if I click close here, you know, I can zoom out. Say, okay, I'm, I'm in that lavatory. So I can actually find where my items are based on the system browser. I can come down to domestic hot water, come down to M water heater, and I can select that. And there's other items that are assigned to it. Sometimes we have unassigned items, but that's fine. Pretty much everything we put into the model is assigned. Domestic hot water. So I can select that water heater, right click, and I'm going to show it. I'm going to hit close, and there's my water heater. If I right click and go to type properties, now here's my domestic hot water. That's my piping system property. So instead of going to the project browser and finding the piping systems, we can come right here. You can right click on any one of these. Now you can change the graphic overrides. You can do whatever you want to do in terms of how that piping system looks. So I'm going to hit cancel here. I'm going to hit escape. There's a couple things we can do. If I click on the column settings button, we can go into general. We can show room name and number. We can show spaces. So for general, I'm just going to click OK. And there's a little fly over here. So we know that the one mechanical room, we have the space name, the space number. So we know that we have that in there. So it's a pretty cool little feature. I recommend you use it. But like I said, it's nice to have another monitor.